Check one, check two. Mike's is live. Mike's is live. Let what up, go, though? Let go, let go. We, we live on the gram, too. Let me see. We got Chase West. What up, baby? Uh, Sexy Dark sexy dark coco oh shit what up though sexy dark coco yeah sexy dark <laughs> sexy dark coco just checked in hi uh, <laughs> <laughs> yes earlier the motherfucker you up with us though so what's happening wake your ass up team gassing in the building man what's the dilly this is the wake and bake the session, wake and bake man. session you feel me we out here live we out here live all right so shit we got sound obviously because i hear it yeah all right let me see we got the comments up and shit we good we good all right, let's go ahead and get this shit popping. It's early as hell. I can't believe niggas is on Instagram this early or on Facebook. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank y'all, though. No shit. Wake and bake sets. Yo, I'm still like mad sleepy as shit, though. Man, fuck you, man. Fuck being sleepy. Uh, All right. man, I'm about to wake your ass up. Right, nigga, it sound like you was just yawning. I was. <laughs> Telling you me to wake up. Click that motherfucking fuck? camera and then uh, whoop. Right, wake your ass up, wake Detroit. Your ass up. All right, y'all niggas ready? This ready. is my show right here, so I, 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 I am. All right, we good? Just excited right. about this show. All right, for sure. All right, so let's go ahead and kick it off. Let's get it. Anybody, let me see. Uh, they get it. Yes, we do the show this early. I thought I answered that already. <laughs> all right, all right, you ready? All right. Let's go. Check one, check two. Stop checking two and let's go. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The Live is Cloud Radio Show on the planet, man. Straight from the E Block Radio. Live on your dial right this moment. Early as fuck. Wake your ass up, Detroit. Wake your ass <laughs> up. In my Martin voice, you know what I'm talking about? It's your boy, the hood, Howard Starr, Q Lewis, holding it down live from the 48205. I got my man Monk Money in the building. Man, you know I'm in this thing. Yeah, we in this bitch early as fit up. We got some people in here already. Oh shit! What up, Michaela? What? I knew you was gonna be woke. What up, though? I think we are gonna have one more person that we always fuck with. Fuck with us this morning. Oh, Venus gonna be sleep. Who, who you talking about? Oh, Sonya Son- Son- might be up. Sonya might be up. Yeah, yeah. What up, Sonya? If you listening right now, we are uh, we already checking for you, baby. It's all good. Right, right, right. Yo, so what, dog? We been off for two weeks. Two weeks. I don't want to get y'all excited because I don't know if this is gonna be the regular time every week. No, no, <laughs> but we just gotta put something out here because you know we've been on for two weeks. We ain't been on for sure. And something just happened. I don't even know what just happened right there, but it just said that I wasn't logged in. <laughs> so hopefully y'all can still see me. Is it still streaming? Yeah. It's still okay. I don't know what just happened right there, but uh, we gonna try to log back in because otherwise I'm not gonna be able to see uh comments, uh, comments and shit. We want to see the comments. Comments ain't up there for sure. They go. <laughs> what the fuck just happened, dog? Oh, shit. I just got a message on Facebook, too. Right. What you just... They cut us off or something? I don't know. Oh, what if they cut us off? What do they do, though? I don't know. Somebody say something. <laughs> She's talking about Monk Sleepy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, we, yeah. We both sleepy. Where the fuck is the thing at, though? Did they cut us off, bro? Mm-hmm. Let me see. I'm about to try to play it right quick. Sleepy. Oh no, nah, we still good. We still good. I don't know what happened though. So I can see. Let me see if we can see the comments on the screen. We sort of can, but I can read them, so we all good. I don't know what just happened right there and shit. They, I guess they tried to kick us off. We ain't even started talking about weed yet. We getting ready to though. So <laughs> so fuck it. We out here. Kick this off. Um, that might be what happened. I'm not even sure. All right, so I can see the comments. Y'all can see them too. Bam! There we go. We back. We back. All right, so Michaela said what up. She said, yeah, I've been checking for you guys for the past two weeks. Thank you, Michaela. I appreciate that shit. Appreciate you, baby. Yeah, we told y'all a couple weeks ago we was going to be off a couple weeks, and, and we did that shit. Yeah, <laughs> we was true to our word. Trying to get our schedules together and shit because uh, at, the, at the time being and shit, this podcast shit ain't the number one income. So got to gotta make this money on the side. You know what I'm saying? Got to get this money on For the sure. Side. But if y'all want to donate, you know, make sure you do that too. Yeah. Also, too, if you see right here. On the uh, on the right hand side of your screen, right there, right at the bottom, our sponsor today, of course, is Pardon My East Side Apparel. Uh, you can go to PardonMyEastSide.com right now, get T-shirts, scullies, fitted hats, and we got hoodies right now. Pardon My East Side, Pardon My West Side, wherever you're from, you can find your label right there. You can get 25% off just by using the promo code EBlock Radio. 25%. Nigga, ain't nobody doing 25% off. Shit, no, we fooling. We fool. That's probably too much of shit, but we just want y'all to buy some shit, so it's all good. So make sure you get What's your t shirts and shit. Right. <laughs> oh, word. That's my auntie. <laughs> um, she am like, why y'all cuss so much? Yeah, somebody just checked in? I didn't see nothing. Yeah, somebody just checked in. Damn, see, that's going to be messed up. I can't even see what's going on for real. I want to see. I guess my uh, my comments ain't strolling. It's fine, let's go. All right, we go, go. All right, so you already know what it is, man. We in here. And we about to talk about something else before we get to the weed, because it's only 10.20. Yeah. We're going to get on that at 10.30. What's been popping, though? It's been two weeks, bro. 
Not much, bro. You know what I'm saying? Stand out the way working, man. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no point staying out the way, dog, because trouble always find us. No, Black no. folks, it well, is. Yeah, I'm I mean, talking I'm saying, though, I'm just I'm staying out the way of that shit. You yeah, know what I'm it's hard to stay out the way, it's though. It's hard to stay out the way, man. It is. You know what I'm saying? It and is. then, you know, they be like, oh, we so mean and evil. And, you know, I'm like, <laughs> like we're some evil creatures, you know? You think because you're dealing with us. the bullshit, you know? Scared of us, you know what I mean? Like, and I'm probably one of the nicest guys you ever met. <laughs> <laughs> one of the nicest guys But you don't make me to You make me to a point Where I want to choke The life out you sometimes You know what Damn, I'm saying That's pretty uh, like, that's, man, that's a lot Bro Like bro <laughs> Get out of my face Right If I slap you bro You ain't been, you ain't seen no movies lately Dog I got so many movies I need to see Dog I, I saw Yeah Venom You did see that did see I, need to, I need to see I, need, I still need to see Halloween I want to see uh, That see new Halloween. Tyler Perry movie And I shit heard Halloween With Tiffany Haddish crazy. A word Yeah I mean all of them Ain't crazy though Cause they want you to See if it's gonna be A sequel and all that shit You know how that go Duh, So I wanna see that I wanna see those too And then there's a, That other shit uh, Where The little kid Get killed by the police yeah. And shit oh, yeah. I wanna, I wanna see that Yeah Star. Is it Star or Something like that yeah. So Glimmer. Where you see all this shit I don't see nobody what? Glimmer I'm trying to see What just happened Dog Why mine ain't showing it Or maybe cause you on the uh, On the mobile app shit I don't know I mean, on the on the phone. So anyway, I I need to see those three, and then I want to see uh, you know, Jonah Hill, the white dude from uh Super Super Bad. Yeah, yeah so he got a new joint, uh, mid mid nineties or something. Yeah, I fuck so, with Jonah. Yes, man. I, yo, I I fuck with him anyway. But then I seen him on the Breakfast Club. I'm like, damn, I fuck with him for real. He like he like black for real or something. Yeah. But like, and not even trying to be though. So that's that's what I dig about it because he kind of like of the culture, but he just regular, like just yeah. like Seth Rogen and yeah, shit. Yeah. And Rogen, or where is it? Seth. The other one, not Seth, Seth Rogen. Rogen. Yeah, Seth, Seth Rogen. Rogen. That is him. No, they, like them two motherfuckers. They like they could be from my hood, bro. Yeah, like for real, for real. Yeah. They could be a Tim. They could be Tim. They could be Tim, right? <laughs> I know, I know a couple. You know what I'm saying? You know, yeah. That's you know what I'm saying. That's 100. And it ain't about them being black. They just 100. You know what right. I'm saying? For sure. You know what I mean, they they see it. They ain't blind, and they you know address it just yeah. as much as we do. You know what I'm saying? So for sure. I don't know how the other people don't see it, but you know, it's another. <laughs> you story. see it? Yeah. <laughs> that's all that matters. That's all that matters. All right, so let me see. I think I, I think I got the right screen up now. I don't even know. We just go. We go hope and pray. I don't know. Thank you, Auntie. Yeah. <laughs> so, yes, you are very nice. I see that now. I see comments. I see y'all comments now. Uh, IG live, man. It look like y'all went dead on us. Y'all must have went back to sleep. But it's okay. So we back. All right. Uh, what else going on? That's it. No uh, movies. No. Movie, you just ready to talk about this week? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Let me see. It gotta be something else. Something had to happen between the last time. We've been off for a long time. Um, damn, it's gotta be some shit going on, right? No, my birthday did my birthday. We birthday. No, nah, we ain't do shit on your birthday. Did, oh, yes, we did. Yes, we, no, did we? No, no, damn, no. I only remember. Happy birthday, nigga. I don't know if we did or not. <laughs> I think I we think did. Nigga, I'm not sure. I, I don't think we did. I just don't remember. But I had a, I had a smashing birthday. I did smashing. Man. Yeah, my birthday was off the chain, bro. You know, yeah. Like, I ate so many different spots, man. Oh my god, bro. Like at the end of the day, bro. Oh no, we didn't. We didn't. Couldn't have. Couldn't no, we couldn't have. have right. Yeah. 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 So we ate. This, I ate so many spots, bro. Like, nigga, at about twelve o'clock, my man pulled up. For sure. Made that nigga get in the car. We went to eat somewhere else, man. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> hey, we ate good as hell on my birthday, though. You know what I'm saying? Hell, yeah. And I pulled up with some White Castles. So we ate that shit, too. Yeah, we ate the White Castle <laughs> on the way to the On the way to the shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's funny, though. Yeah, that's, that's the kind of birthday I like, man. Eating finances, you know, hanging out with the dogs and my fam. You know what I mean? My brother sure. came into town. For sure. Yeah, shout and out to Joint. We just ate good, man. Just ate really good, you know. Exa ate really good. Yeah, not party, good, but really good. Party, he know he a drinker. I'm not a drinker. <laughs> I'm on, I'm what we talking about in a minute. You feel me? <laughs> Yo, who a drinker? Not bro. Not how he was sleep at the motherfucking table. Uh, <laughs> That's why. No, he was sleep. Yo, he was turned up though, bro. He was turned up on the way there. Yeah. We got to that motherfucker. He like. <laughs> 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 he woke up with that food got there though. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I was just about to say, oh, you, you reading them all right. Never mind. <laughs> I was about to read it for you. I forgot. You can read comments now. Read them motherfuckers sometimes. I think I get tired of doing that shit. Happy birthday, Monk Money. Thank you, McCabe. All right, for sure. That's what's up. <laughs>
All right, so, man, fuck it. Let's get to it, dog. It's 1025, man. Wake your ass up, Detroit, and everywhere else you at, because we're getting ready to talk about wake and bake, all right? Well, first of all, let me tell you why we're talking about it, though, all right? Because, I mean, obviously, we uh we, we like we like uh, marijuana, yeah. but uh, the reason we're talking about it, though, is that, at least in Michigan, it's on the ballot right now to make it legal, all right? So, that's what we want to talk about. And before we, get into, uh, before we get into that, Dan, let me also say this. Since we're talking about voting on Tuesday, um, I know some people are thinking some of these regions, I think they might have already voted like last week or some shit. I don't know. But our voting day is tomorrow. I mean, uh, is this uh, this Tuesday. So my thing, though, about voting, I think for real, black people, we have we having a serious moment right here. White people, too, if y'all want to listen. I- I'm not sure. But uh, my people, though, I think that one of these elections like that come- that's coming up Tuesday are or is rather for your for your local government and some of the local shit going on so i think these are probably a lot more important than the the national vote i'm not saying that you shouldn't go out and vote nationally but at the same time if you are going to vote i think this is probably the best time because it's going to change the shit that's immediately surrounding you Mm -hmm. all right so that's all i want to say i'm going to vote um probably Probably solely because the weed shit is on the ballot, but uh, <laughs> but I'm involved with some other shit too. And uh, I did some I did some research on some of the judges and shit because that's important for us too. Even though I'm not trying to be in no criminal uh, issues no time soon, but at the same time though, I what what happened? Here's the door. Oh, I don't know. Was that the door? Sound like it. Might be. We give it a second. It might be two G's. But uh. But yeah, I want to do some research on those uh, because even though I don't want to get into no criminal uh, issues right at this moment, I want to know at least who I'm gonna be in front of if, if that shit pop off. Yeah, you know, so she gonna hang your ass. yeah, she gonna hang your ass or what? So you kind of these are things that you need to know. You know what I'm saying? So make sure you get out there and vote on Tuesday. Again, to me, it's not as important, or yeah, it's not as important during the national shit because we kind of don't have control over that. But your local government, man, fuck around. Cast a vote, dog. Got Ta- to, got to. Take a look. We got too many more. We got too many homies for real. We got too many homies in jail and shit to not be worried about who we putting in, in the in yeah. the courts and shit. Because yeah. too many niggas be seeing the wrong judge and be getting the book through at their ass. You hear me? Yo, what up, dog? My man Julie's just checked in. Shout out to Colorado doing their thing, man. Uh, uh, Ju- what? Damn, Julie, what's your uh, goddamn it? Uh, life is dope. Yes, life is dope. Shout out to his uh. His podcast out there in Colorado, you know, they out there doing their thing. Check them out on SoundCloud. My man Julius was good. What's good? All right, so fuck it. Let's fuck around, dog. Tuesday, Tuesday. Tuesday. On the ballot. On the ballot. The weeds. The weeds. Now, speaking of Colorado, though, obviously it's, it's legit all the way around out there. Yeah. And obviously, I think life is good. Yes. Life is dope. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right. Life yeah, is dope, baby. literally. Yeah, baby. This motherfucker is amazing. That is. Denver, man. That was the door. Uh, yeah. Two G's two G's must be in the studio coming right now. So uh, if you if you check us out right now while we waiting on him to come down, hit us in the comment box, let us know what you think, man. We legalization of we is on the ballot in Michigan. Uh, this week, dog, we want to know what y'all think. I, like I said, I know we got some people on from Colorado. Let us know how it's doing in, in y'all neck of the woods, man, because we definitely think that it's going to do us some good. Some more money, dog. What you say, dog? Legalizing we, what's the effects of that shit on the ballot? Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> angry man, what up though? Yo, I thought that was two G's. What's up, angry man? What's good, baby? Your ass up, right, wake <laughs> your ass up, Detroit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, now let me tell you my comment. <laughs> <laughs> it does nothing, bro. Like it, it, it will make Detroit better, bro. Like this is not like alcohol, bro. I don't know how they can compare weed and alcohol, bro. It's a different, totally different effect, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You don't get belligerent. You don't get nothing. You know what I'm saying? Why not legalize it and let this stay proper more? You know, it's prosper yeah. more. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're right. I already. Right. <laughs> let it prosper more because, I mean, I, I literally went to Denver, bro. And my yeah. first time in Denver, bro. My first time even being close that way. Right. And it was amazing in Denver, bro. Yeah. Schools was great. Schools great. Streets, the streets was amazing. Was good. Don't get me wrong. It's still some fucked up streets. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. but it's still everywhere. It's going to be I'll, I'll, I'll buy Aurora where I live because that's basically, uh, I guess, what you would probably consider the hood, I guess. Right, right. right. So I went to <laughs> it's a bunch of It's a bunch of us and Mexicans and shit. Yeah. Shout out to the Mexicans. Yeah, it was my dog. I went to visit my dog in Denver, man. For sure. And it was amazing, bro. Like, it was beautiful, bro. It's beautiful. Like, Mich- Michigan, the air is clean. The Michigan is beautiful off rip. Yeah, you know true that, saying? true like, that. Period, bro. Like, hands down, one of the most beautiful shits I ever seen. Not just because I stay in it. Yeah, the water and nature, nature and shit. And nature, trees you know and shit. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I, and I and I'm a black dude, and I went hunting before, bro. You know what yeah. I mean? And, and I 
I liked it. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> exactly. I, I, liked I, it. I, I thought I did. You know, I yeah. thought like, man, I ain't sleeping on no ground on and all that crap and all that crap. <laughs> bro, it's, it's actually beautiful, bro. I sat there for at least four hours just staring at the woods, bro. <laughs> wow. I mean, it that's because you was high, nigga. It could have been because. <laughs> yeah. But still, though, it was beautiful, though. Right. You know what I'm saying? So you know what I'm saying? Just let you know. Let his nature take its course because it's all nature, baby. It's all, it's all nature. nature. It come from the dirt. You know what I'm talking about? Do it come from the dirt when you do that whole little okay. dirt. You know what I'm saying? That's all right. I'm about the dirt. You all right. Me? All right. You feel me? What the fuck out of here? I think we should legalize it for sure, for sure, man. Yeah. Just because our schools ain't shit. The lottery don't help our schools. They said do, but our schools ain't shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Great schools mean, you know what I'm saying? Well, I, I won't say that. I, I'll say that our our inner city schools ain't shit. That's what I'm saying. That's yeah, what I'm saying. there's some other schools around the state though that are, yeah, are very, very prosperous. Yeah. But I think that's also because of the population and shit. I think so. I don't know. There's a whole lot of shit going on with that. Sorry, Auntie. I had to do this. <laughs> Angry man. What's good, dog? Ain't shit happening. What you think about that shit, man? It's on the ballot for Tuesday, bro. Legalizing weed, though, you think it's gonna be a? What, is is it gonna be a problem if it does become legal? Like, what's what you think, bro? I think what's gonna be the problem? I mean, shit, you legalize alcohol. Right. <laughs> well, well, for, well. Let me say this then for the for the people who who not hip and shit. I they are they are basically campaigning against it and shit. So they, they campaign against it is that there's gonna be too many. Uh, they saying there's gonna be too many minors getting access to uh, to weed. The crime is going to increase. And productivity is going to decrease. That's this is this is the this is what the the ads are saying on TV to get you to vote against it. Yeah. I don't know. I'm saying these are the ads. I don't know. Shit, it ain't me, so I couldn't tell. You. <laughs> then it would be if it was legal. Probably so. I, I agree. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I definitely. Uh. The crime, the crime is going to increase. How? Yeah, the crime is going to increase because it's Christmas time. <laughs> <laughs> you know what you're legalizing weed on the ballot. Right. You know what I'm saying? How's crime going to increase? All right. Now, I'm going to tell you the, the, the number one thing, though, which which I, it wasn't opposition, but it was one of the reasons why I got shot down in the, in the, in the state Senate, which I get. Like, I actually understand this one. And it was, it was because they said that they didn't want to legalize it unless uh, they would let out all of the the, uh, the weed offenders out of jail. Like, if they can't do that, then they won't legalize it. That, I get it, because they're trying to leverage that. So they're saying, like, if you're going to make it legal, let the homies out of jail. I get that. So I can I can understand that, but at the end of the day, we know that that's not going to happen. So if you're leveraging that, that means it's never going to happen. My thing is, we got to take one thing at a time, bro. We got yeah. this right here on the ballot, you know what I'm saying? Get that there first, yeah. then we and then start, get them out. Then start working on, yeah. you know what I'm saying, getting the homies out. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, let's take one thing at a time, bro. Like, what you expect? So if it don't get voted, so what they going to be? They still going to be in jail. They still going to be in jail. <laughs> You feel me? So, I mean, I'm just yeah. saying, we got to take one thing at a time, though. You know what I'm saying? Start with that. Then we can start with <laughs> say everybody going to get high. Everybody, yeah. Everybody get high already, though. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. And and then how crime going to increase? Am going to be too high? Like, <laughs> I, don't, I don't think the crime increased uh, in Colorado. No. You know what I'm saying? And, and the roads are a lot better because they're... That's tax money. They're using the tax money. Now, now granted, in Michigan, I'm not sure uh, how how uh, non-corrupt our government is. So, more tax money might s still not mean shit for us. But at least we have something to show for it. You know what I'm saying? So, Makeda says she don't get high. I'm sorry to hear that. Right. <laughs> I'm very sorry to hear that. Well, you should indulge. I'm sorry. But um, All that stress you talking about? <laughs> is that all that stress? <laughs> No, but I I don't really think so though. For for me, I I think that it should be it should be a good thing. But but I will tell you this though, even though we voting on it on Tuesday, I think that I think that they already in position to make that shit happen regardless. Yeah. And the reason I say that is because I don't know if y'all peep, but they they back on that shit though. They shutting down niggas who ain't running their shit properly. Mm -hmm. when, no, you know when they start doing shit like that, that means that they trying to go ahead and take that shit over. And that's why I was so mad. 
when niggas was getting their uh, dispensaries and shit, trying to make that quick dollar, turn the dispensary to like a fucking spot and shit. Uh -huh. In real life, if you'd have got your paperwork right, got that shit together, you can roll with right. the real yeah. shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, dog, you got to understand that the weed shit is so real right now that, that some of these dispensaries got publicly traded motherfucking stocks, bro. Yes. Like, you can invest in weed in real life, nigga. High, high times. Nigga. Yes, nigga, right. High times is publicly yeah. traded, dog. Yeah. Like, so while you fucking around trying to make a uh, 100000 in the hood and shit, nigga, you can be in that bitch for longevity. Okay. Your kids can have motherfucking weed money and never and never touch weed. Mm -hmm. Like, dog, I don't think, I don't think <laughs> niggas understand. And that's why, that's why for me, quite honestly, legalizing the weed because, like, I mean, like, in real life, we smoke already. You know what I'm saying? So, it's not going to make me a difference. It's a miracle drug. They right. don't want us to have that, man. Why you don't want us to have that? It's a miracle drug, bro. Aches and pains. Shit, you, you know, know why? Because pharmaceuticals will start losing our money. You know, <laughs> yeah. you know what I'm saying? I really want to tax, bro. It does so many different things, bro. People just think, you know, weed just to get high. No, it ain't. Yeah. Like, this dude got some cream, yeah. medical cream. Uh-huh. Cannabis medical cream. Yeah. With no CBT, no all that bullshit. Yeah. And my put that shit on my shoulder, bro. <laughs> no, that you shit, that me? shit really do work. You dog, understand? I understand. Yeah. Like I understand. Like it's a miracle drug, bro. Like it does so many different <laughs> things, bro. <laughs> that shit really work for joint pain. I ain't gonna lie. Though. It do. Like a joint, a joint really do work for joint pain. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Smoke the joint, the pain in the joint's gone for real. That's right. how I go, man. Yeah, for sure. I'm sure. campaign my shit. Yeah. I get my this bit about bud and breakfast. Yeah, bud and breakfast. <laughs> when I get my bud and breakfast when they look. A joint like, that keeps the joint pains away. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, we should have said that live. Like, he stole that shit up. Fuck ass, bro. Coco J just checked in. What up, though? She said, What up, fellas? What up, though? What's good? She's still in that work and shit. You can't be stealing and watching us at work, man. It's probably gonna get you fired and shit. Right, right, right. <laughs> we, we talk about some outlandish shit. But, um, yeah, so I, I think for, for me, like I said, just looking at that shit, legalizing it on the ballot for me ain't even about getting high because we like we already got access to weed for me though i think it, it's gonna open up some it's gonna open up some finances for for some black people to start empowering ourselves a lot of people. for real right yeah and a lot of people but you know i'm always looking out first yeah. but a lot of people this is gonna be an opportunity for people to change the motherfucking scope of uh economics and shit because you figure it's a lot of people who really are I mean, they are excellent at this weed trade. Yes. <laughs> excellent at, 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 at motherfucking growing life. it and shit. My whole life. And all that shit, right? And this is an opportunity for people to capitalize off of that. This is no different than, like, uh, not going to college and going to a trade school and shit. You already have a trade. Why not nigga, Why not get paid for it? You right. know what I'm saying? And this is the same thing. And I don't think that it's go. This is probably the same argument they had with alcohol, I'm that's guessing. What I, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Like, like, I'm, I'm pretty dude, sure. They came in and got that quick money. Was they bootlegging? Yeah, they was bootlegging. <laughs> right, they was bootlegging. Yeah, bootlegging. Shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And then when, when they didn't want to legalize it, then the, the mafia took that bitch over and started yeah. bootlegging that shit from Canada yeah. somewhere. Yeah. So, like, I think this is probably the same argument. You see what happened with that? Yeah. And, then they, and that's probably, dog, that's, that industry is booming. Yeah. You're talking about the, the alcohol in this country got to be making like almost as much money as the drugs that they bringing over illegally. <laughs> sure. You didn't, you didn't catch that though, did you? Sure. That's the government taking that illegal yeah. drugs and shit. But, um, sure. but yeah, it's, it's making that kind of money. You're talking about, Criminals. you talking about you pulling up in the hood, right? Trying to get a bar. Like you, let's say you get a bar in, in like a tough place where you probably not going to make a, a lot of money. You still got to pay $30,000 for a liquor license. Uh -huh. Like, for some shit that you probably gonna sell two shots a week and shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. And you ain't even bought liquor yet. This is just to be able to sell it, right? And then, like, our taxes, man. Yeah, taxes a motherfucker. It's a, it's a motherfucker, bro. Like, 6% tax on yeah. every fucking thing. That shit Everything. is killing us. Even though it's like 8 or some shit in New York. Or probably more than that yeah, by now. Yeah, New York. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah it's, but it's New York, yeah, huh? It's, yeah. The motherfuckers, they need to chill out in New York too with that <laughs> shit, though. And they tax everything they though. Tax they they everything, tax the food bro. and all kind come of on, shit. Come on, bro. Like everything. Yeah, hey, I remember I bought a bottle of water in that bitch, and, and they charge you tax for that because they ain't got because they know. I think it ain't no deposit or some shit. If I stayed in New York, bro, these poor niggas probably be robbing for cigarettes, bro. <laughs> Them bitches like twenty dollars a pack in that bitch. <laughs> you would, like, you would think so though, right? Like you go to some places, you see how how motherfucking high it is. You know what I'm saying, like. I don't know how people are surviving. Like in Colorado, it's expensive as shit. Yeah. I understood why I see so many homeless people. But then I tell you, uh, I gotta tell y'all about this, man. Shout out to Colorado. I don't know if I mentioned this story before, but when I was out there, I was at the gas station, dog, and the motherfucker hit me up, right, with bum and shit. Asked me to add some change and shit, right? So I'm like, you know what, fuck it. I, he like he was down on his luck. I had like a couple cords and some shit. 
I roll over to a nigga, I'm like, dog, you know, that's what I got for you and shit. You know what that motherfucker told me? He said, damn, bro, you ain't got no dollar? My nigga, do you know that I, I smacked that nigga hands and so that motherfucking 50 cent rolled somewhere? Because <laughs> then I got, then that east side shit came out of me, nigga. He was like, damn, bro, you ain't got no dollar? I was like, nigga, you ain't got shit, man, nigga. What the fuck wrong with you, dog? Yo, I got in the truck, man, as fuck. Like, this is what, this is what the fuck I moved to, dog? Like you, you motherfucking ungrateful ass bitch. Is you serious? You like, like, damn, you ain't got no dollar, bitch. You ain't got shit now, nigga. Right. Go scrub the motherfucking curves for the damn two quarters, nigga. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? Shout out to Colorado, though. I love them niggas. They get like that here. They get like that here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish a nigga would, man. Wow. One motherfucker, man. You know, every day this nigga hit me up the chain. Yeah. He's like, you got something. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> nigga, I'm giving you every day, nigga. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna be right out here with your ass. Yeah. 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 Crazy, bro. Right. I, I, honestly, I went to the car wash. You know what I'm saying? My man messing around, he even wiped my car down. Nah, nah. I gave nigga two dollars still. Yeah. Like that's all I get, bro. You ain't did shit. I said, what you do, cuz? Right. He like, I'm like, you stay here on the phone talking your back and wiping the car, nigga. Got too, you doing too much, yeah, bro. You doing too much. I'm out here wiping my car. If you I got to if I got to get out, my car, yeah, that shouldn't give you I shit. I shouldn't give you nothing, nigga. If I got to get, get out here, that bitch. That's all I get, cuz. Damn, niggas were out here like, man, man, get the fuck out my face, bro. Now you getting two dollars worth of work. It ain't like no. I gave it to you before you did some yeah, shit. Like, I, I ain't gonna lie, up there. Uh, right around the way and shit It ain't shit but like five dollars So usually I got a ten any motherfucker way So I'm gonna get a nigga five yeah. Unless you fuck up yeah. And you ain't you ain't did shit worth it Like nigga I ain't fuck you, with you. you You ain't got no You ain't got no five man No man hey, I, I thought know, it you know, I thought a nigga five if he, if he working If I'm outside <laughs> If I had to sit out there and wait on you then I had to get outside and say, fuck, I'm going to start drying my shit off myself. Then you like, hold on, player, I got that. You ain't getting you shit. Ain't get shit. <laughs> Hell no. Because if we was at the channel. restaurant, nigga, you wouldn't get shit. I gave $2. Even yeah, though you I got here trying to hustle, I, I still gave nigga $2. But fucking nigga, around. Nigga, man, get out of my face, bro. Right. Like, I, 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 I started snatching my $2 back. Hell like, yeah. Like, get my money back, man. Oh, fuck, I ripped that bitch. I made nobody get it, nigga. I don't want to make no sin over $2. but Be petty as fuck. Right. Like, oh, damn, that's all. I'm like, hold on, man. He ain't gave it all to the white man. I'm like, now, see, now you, see, now you ain't getting it. Yeah, right. Now you ain't getting nothing. You know, I was reaching the gate. Right, because you, you had gave him the dollar by accident trying to grab the fire. Right. Motherfuckers. I don't even know. I'm grateful, bro. Man, you don't need to tell me why. <laughs> right. You niggas don't hold this shit. <laughs> man, y'all need to be panhandling. That's what it feel like to me. You be work. If you ain't work for it, I see a nigga ain't hustling. Nigga, you even had it. Hell yeah. You doing like in my car wiping down my windows. I might give him a motherfucking sack. You smoke? Dog. You smoke? Here. Yeah. Dog, tell you, I had niggas, <laughs> I had niggas do that though. Like open the door and get all that inside yeah. shit out. Nigga, you get lit, bro. Oh, Hell yeah, no. shit. I had niggas too do all that shit. Do, do all that shit and then still try to sell me CDs too. I ain't mad at your hustle. I just didn't, I just didn't want one. But it's cool though. Like, look at, oh, oh, this your mixtape, my nigga? All right, bet. <laughs> right. But look, just take this though. Just take this tip, nigga. I want your mixtape. Uh, shout out to Armani just checked in. What up, though? Give me the mixtape. Right. Right. Armani just checked in. She said, what up? Coco J said she down for it. Oh, you trying to get high? Oh, shit. Look at you. Oh, look at that, Who are you? Who the Will, fuck are you? What the hell you been at? Right. You used to. Mug it up. You stay. <laughs> right. Now she's like, where do we eat at, nigga? Oh, man. Hell no. My man Marcus just checked in. What up, though, Marcus? Yeah, we early one day, late the next day. You know how we do, man. We fucking around. So. But no, anyway, uh, my bad. We got way off track. But uh, <laughs> that motherfucker said, bro, you ain't got no dollars, man, and shit. But anyway, outside of that, though, like I said, I think that uh, out there is a little bit different just because the, the, the price of living is so fucking high. It's like out there, it ain't no in-between. It's like either either you got it or you don't. It's like, nigga, either you, you, you working or you if you ain't got no job, nigga, it's the complete fall off. Like, it's yes. fucked up out there. Out here, it's not as bad because the economy ain't as fucked up as it is out there. Because it's like, again, it ain't no middle ground. So here, I don't think that's going to be a problem. Like, now, there may be there may be an issue with employment at first. Because I'm pretty sure Colorado had to deal with that shit somehow, too. Because, yeah. like, at some point, if weed is legal, like, how you really go keep drug tests for all these jobs and shit. Yeah. Which, I, again, they may be able to do that. 
So e even if that's the case, then you just got to get clean and get a job, then it just can't be you no know, like, no surprise motherfucking drug test because obviously niggas is getting high. And, and of course, you can't be high on the job. Like, it's like, Drinking is legal, but you can't be drunk at work. They go fire your ass. You know what I'm saying? Like it's the same shit. Same shit. It ain't no different. Like nigga, just because it's legal don't mean that you gonna have the right to do that motherfucker everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Like so, I, I think people blowing that shit out of proportion, not looking at the bigger picture. They worried about motherfuckers getting high. Worry about them uh them opioids and shit because them the motherfuckers that's going crazy, killing motherfuckers. Because and shit. everybody get high, dog. Everybody got a vice. I don't fuck liquor. You get high off liquor. You get yeah, high. it's, it's high. high. Right. It's high. Sure. So I don't care what nobody say. People call it drunk. They don't want to say drunk. They don't want to say high. Yeah. But you high as hell off liquor, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. And motherfuckers function around that shit every day. Yeah. And they just treat it just like you do liquor. It's gonna be legal, bro. Whether y'all like it or not, bro. At some point. At some point it's gonna be legal, bro. Yeah. And so, and because of that, man, you niggas better get on board. Yeah, I'm about yeah. to I'm about to try to find me some stock somewhere. Well, some weed yeah. stock. It's coming, baby. It's coming. Boy. I'm you might just have me a couple hundred dollars sit there or something. High Shit. Times is throwing out advertisement for investors who everybody wants to That's what I'm saying. Man, jump on board right now. I think this is a good time, dog, you for say, real. But all in the same sense, like, you got to be willing to lose your investment also. Like, oh, I mean, it's the truth. Man. That's that's the stock market. Shit. Yeah. You got to be willing to lose. Yeah. And that's when that's when group economics come in and shit. So for... Uh, all group economics mean basically it's like uh, us pooling together and shit and buying stock. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think a lot of people scared to do that because it is a risk. But shit, selling dope is a risk, nigga. Like, so your your shit might get took, or you might go to jail, nigga. All that shit's a risk. So what's the difference? And this is a this is a legal risk though. Yes. That could possibly set you and your family up, like. Like the the dope risk, man. Unless you taking the for real risk, nigga. Like, it's. It, you're not making that much money You know what I'm saying Like You could, you could probably get paid Like it's better than Going to a 9 to 5 and, and shit and But for millions I might try to risk Going to jail For that motherfucking million Yeah but you know Where, where you gotta be On the food chain To be worth millions Yeah that's what I'm saying <laughs> yeah. think worth millions I'm gonna try it I'm <laughs> so gonna, gonna think back at it You feel me You're gonna try like Sorry yeah, son yeah, Sorry man, boy Sorry I, son I may even come back I may not I but may I love not you. But I'll see you through the glass, my nigga. See you through the glass. Give me the palm through the glass. <laughs> no, that's funny. <laughs> it's funny, but it ain't funny because there's so many niggas crazy. living that life right now, nigga. Yeah. Right now. Shout out to y'all, man. So I, let's legalize weed and we can you know, less with that stress. Yeah. Smoke on the sass. <laughs> <laughs> that's your shit. Say it again. One more time. Less on the stress. Smoke on the sass. <laughs> That should be your campaign and shit. That's what's up, dude. Yeah, for real. Real talk, though. You know what real I'm talk, saying? Real like, talk. No, yeah, for like, real. It, it really, bro, it's a miracle drug, bro. Yeah. Like, I don't understand. Like, people put so much hate on it. Like, now, now I know, like, running into, like, in the business in the industry I am, bro, like, everybody doing it. Yeah. Lawyers. I think that's, I think doctors, that's the, I think that might be the bottom line, though. I think that they, they're afraid that that shit uh, start making motherfuckers healthier and that's go fuck up the, you know. Yeah, I, I really think that's true. And we, we fat as hell around these parts. <laughs> Right, Michigan one of the fattest fattest places on earth. Yeah, yeah. fattest place on earth at one point in time. Hell yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm in the gym though. I'm trying to not be a part. <laughs> I wasn't wasn't a shot at cuz. Whatever. I don't give a fuck, nigga. Shit. I've been <laughs> I've been struggling with weight my whole life, nigga. I'm not afraid to say it, nigga. I have been, and a lot of motherfuckers who have. But I smoke weed too and shit. And I go to the gym occasionally. Right. But I eat a lot of motherfucking pizza though. <laughs> I eat a lot too, bro. I eat more like I supposed to be obese. You know, where I eat, <laughs> right, you should be. Should you eat be. like a fat nigga for real. But I move every constant. For sure. Constantly Edward move. Davis just constantly. checked in. What up, bro? What up, though? Yeah. But um, yeah. So anyway, my bad. Back to uh, yeah. <laughs> back to the marijuana. Yeah. So yeah, it's on a, it's on the ballot in Michigan. I think uh, it already got it got passed in in California, right? I yeah. believe on the last ballot. So it, it's coming. It's getting more states. It's getting involved and shit. And I think it's gonna be a whole lot of shit though. Like it's gonna be, it's gonna bleed over into the uh, CCW shit because now they saying like they don't want you to have access to weed and the motherfucking uh, permit. So right now I don't know how that'll change because they talking about uh, for at least people who had who didn't have it already. If you get a marijuana card, then you can't get a CCW. But that's gonna change also uh, with the time. Yeah, because I figure if it's if it's legal, then you won't need a card. So like, how you go know? You know what I'm saying? Like, how you gonna know? So you go drug and, test and, niggas and, to and get a gun? Guns been going around ever since liquor been going around. Man. So motherfuckers can't stop that. You can't right. stop the guns. You can't stop the drugs. You can't right. stop the none of the shit. So motherfucker, this shit been going on all my yeah. life. I've been seeing it all my life, bro. Yeah. Guns. Liquor, right? Wheaties, 
My my whole oh, thing is drugs. I feel I feel the drugs part. Just but the the narcotics. I feel the narcotics. Uh-huh. Like that shit can't be legal. Like no, that no. that's just yeah, that's just got to be illegal. <laughs> but when you talk about weed and shit, to me that's kind of in the same position as alcohol. I really don't know how it took this long to become legal and shit. Right. I figured the motherfucking the Woodstock probably got their point across and shit uh-huh. and they the been did this yeah. shit, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. And those are all white people. All white people. <laughs> Shout out to some of the black people who went, you know, the one yeah. or two that had white friends. But my oh again, damn, we we waited extra late, my bad. But y'all y'all see the logo on the bottom of the screen, dog. Shout out to the New Orleans Talk Network, our new partners down in New Orleans. Uh we have been partners with them for a while, but they just reached back out to us and, and renewed our partnership. Mm-hmm. So uh so we down, we streaming in New Orleans right now too. So check out make sure you check out New Orleans Talk Network dot com. I know they probably say New Orleans, but I'm gonna say New Orleans because I'm, I'm up the north. N-O. <laughs> right, the N O N O T N New Orleans Talk Network, man. Shout out to them for showing us some love on their page. So we streaming live here and on their page. So we out here doing that's big things. You know what I'm talking love. about? That's love. For sure. Shout out to the people checking us out on IG Live too. I ain't forget about y'all, but ain't nobody say nothing yet, so I didn't have a chance to read I nothing. It. Right, you forgot it. And all y'all see is the green screen right now. Y'all can't see the actual background, so <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Anyway, also, too, don't forget to download the uh, eBlock Radio mobile app, all right? So make sure you download that. Anyway, all right. So back to legal, legalizing marijuana. So for me, myself, definitely, I am going to vote for it. And I think the the reason being, again, like I said, it's not, I guess I'm not looking at it the way the politicians are looking at it as far as, like, the crime increasing and shit because, I don't know, we from the 48205, dog. Like, we've been living in this shit our whole life. We've been living in this shit our whole life, and I feel like crime... Crime is bad. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna lie and say that the shit ain't you know ain't probably worse than than when we was kids and shit. But at the end of the day though, I don't think legalizing marijuana is go is gonna be an issue with that. I think they smoking it anyway. Yeah. So the issue the issue is still going to remain for me anyway. Crime in, inside the city. The issue for me is always going to remain the lack of education, the lack of resources, and the lack of jobs and shit. That's that's the motherfucking contributor to crime. Niggas getting high because niggas, niggas getting high because they ain't got no job. That's what happened in the, that, that's what happened in the eighties. Motherfuckers started smoking crack because they was shutting down plants and shit. That's what happened in Flint. Like, Flint had one of the biggest motherfucking, what was it, Chrysler plants? One of them damn plants. But shit, the motherfucking start shutting down plants. Niggas ain't got no job. But then they was like, fuck it, we go get high. And then they start freebasing and shit. And then, you know, roller coaster down from there. And then they start putting lead in the water and all, all hell broke oh, loose. Oh, oh, oh. So they just had been fucking over Flint for a long time. Oh, man. I'm sorry for my Flint brothers and sisters, man. I feel for y'all for real. Shout, Shout out to y'all. Out to and see, that's another thing, though. You figure you get that tax money off the weed in the state. They shouldn't have no problem fixing that shit up there. That's, for why, real. that's why Obama was here. Man, it's all a, it's all a fucking scheme, bro. Obama yeah. was here. Yeah. The from that, what's her name? Uh what's her name? What's her name? Joe Biden. Joe Biden? Joe, no, she was Who we talking about? He was for the lady. She he was for the lady. What the fuck is she talking about? Obama came here to talk for the lady. What's her name? Oh, uh, you talking about just the other yeah. day at Cash and shit? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, I can't think of her name. Richard her Whitmore, I think that's her Richard. name. Is Richard. Is Richard? Oh, Gretchen. Gretchen. Yeah, Gretchen. 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 Yeah. Gretchen. Shout out to Gretchen. Whitmore. You know what I'm saying? And she promised to do the schools. She promised they to all do the water that. and they all do that. Yeah. She promised to do all this shit. You know what I'm saying? They all do that. But, man, she had Obama back in there. Yeah. So she about to have Obama back in there. What do you think the money that's gonna come from yeah. for her to get all this shit going going? Right, it will come from the weed taxes. It's they say go ahead and legalize to. that shit. It's going to, bro. Yeah. I really think it's already written. Me me personally, bro. Like me personally, I, agree. I think this shit is already written. I agree. No matter the vote or not. I agree. Like, I honestly not, I mean That's I why they shut a, that's why they shutting shit down. I wouldn't they, be a dickhead, a stickler and say I don't vote. Yeah, but I don't because <laughs> said, but I don't. I mean, it don't, it don't matter what yeah. my little shit's gonna say because they already got their little look. Like they like voting on some shit called proposal two with a fucking. They get in one room and politicians and pick what. Oh, uh, gerrymandering. Gerrymandering. Yeah, that shit been going on for years. So what? Which, which is my vote call, call which call. is real shit, and you know how real that is when. You have to put it into the the ballot. You, <laughs> you know how real that shit is. Come on, bro. That shit been going on. That's why I'm saying, like, man, I'm not knocking people who go vote. I mean, I understand. Do your thing, but. But then at the end of the day, too, though, just to go back on that gerrymandering shit. Um, because again, vote it in or vote it not, I'm still gonna smoke. 
I feel for people who, uh, like I said, gerrymandering basically is just the the for real term for uh, basically getting getting the vote behind door closed doors. So basically, like you get the the people that you know will vote yes for for whatever you trying to propose, mm-hmm. and then all y'all go into the back room and shit and, and basically pass the vote. You know what I'm saying? Know. Yeah, so so that that's basically what that is, and so much of that shit is going on, obviously in Michigan, that they had to actually put it on the ballot to like to to make people stop doing it. Now the thing is though, I know how politicians work and shit. I know how politics work. So at the end of the day, man, I ain't I ain't even go complain. You just go have to start to figure out how to get inside the rooms, cause you ain't gonna stop the rooms from from being there. So you just go have to figure out how to get in that bitch and bust that motherfucker wide open. Cause voting for this shit ain't. I ain't gonna say it won't change them, but it probably won't. Cause I mean, you figure that shit been going on for a long ass time. So if they had to put it on the fucking, if you had to put it on the ballot, it's you know obviously that's been why, going that's on for why a minute. I just gave up on the vote. You know yeah, said <laughs> so you gave up. I did. Don't tell our youth that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I said, I'm sorry. Put your head down and shit. <laughs> yeah, we we got like four minutes left, man. Hit me in the comment box and let us know what you think. The effects of legalizing marijuana, man. It is on the Michigan's ballot on Tuesday. So if you're in Michigan, you'll be able to vote yes or no on legalizing marijuana. But uh, like I said, I think we all in agreement that uh, we go, we going to vote yes or those of us who are voting are going to vote yes. Let go of the stress. Smoke on the sass. <laughs> no, we need to we need to really record that. Like you gotta see it just like that too. That's the only way it's gonna be believable. You gotta oh see it just God. like that. For real. Right, put that shit on the shirt. Yeah, bro, that- and hit us in the comment box right now, man. You got a couple minutes, man. Let us know what you think the effects are gonna be. I think that it, I think that it, it it couldn't be nothing but helpful. I mean, you you gotta figure right now with the tax money that we do get and the money off of and the, the money off of uh, the lottery and shit, like, they can't seem to get the schools together. So let's add something else in there. And then they can't get the roads put together without trying to charge us 10 extra motherfucking dollars for your Michigan registration and all that shit, you know? Yeah. Like, at the end of the day, I get it. Like, um, if it's going to cost me five extra dollars on my registration and shit for every person uh, renewing their registration and shit to fix the roads, I'm cool with it. Yeah. But then when you do that and the roads still fucked up, then you, you left wondering on, what bro, the bro, fuck bro, is going bro, on. Come on, bro, bro, bro. Ch- check this out, though. Check this out. The roads are fucked up. Yeah. And the insurance is fucked up. Like, yeah. bro. Oh, the insurance is one of the worst in the, in oh the country. Oh, my God, bro. Like, we pay so a million we dollars. Wanna, we one of the few uh, states who still have uh, no fault shit. Niggas yeah. got to pay $1,000 to drive every month, bro. Yeah. Basically, I mean, your, your insurance can legit be more than your car note. Yes, bro. Like, and, if, and if you got a bucket bro. for real, like that you ain't paying no uh, car note on and shit, and then you turn around and paying $500 a month for some fucking insurance, yeah, and then you man. wonder why niggas out here riding with no insurance. Man, come on, that, that's why, nigga. I mean, you leave Colorado, I was paying $160. For insurance, like wow. full coverage insurance, nigga. Wow. Right, exactly. Come back to this bitch, that same shit is like three ninety something. Three ninety. It's like four hundred dollars, eh? And then don't don't be from four eight two zero five because they redline in which they say they don't. But obviously, when you put in the shit in the computer, it say are you what it say are you south of Seven Mile and what it, and west of Chalmers, I think it is some shit like that, like. So then you got to click in there and then the motherfucking price change. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> what you mean there ain't no red line? What the fuck? Like, niggas is... I, I ain't even going to say that. I, I am going to say it. Niggas getting murdered. They ain't getting their car stuff. I, right. I'm just saying. Anyway, Word but... uh. Shout out, to, uh, shout out to nephew. What up, though? He said the best thing that happened to the world. He said the classic pothead way. Yes, sir. <laughs> That's yes, what's sir. up, dog. Make sure you check out my man to the classic pothead. Check him out on Instagram. Uh, also, I think his website up. I don't know. If it ain't, we got to talk about it. So get your shit back going. Uh, Stephanie Zadie. Is that Zadie or Zadie? Stephanie just checked in, gave us a thumbs up. She probably smoking with us right now. Thanks, yeah, Steph. Yeah, blow on. For checking us out. All right, we got one minute, dog. Angry man, what'd you say? Fuck that shit. <laughs> right, legalize that shit. <laughs> More money. What you say, bro? <laughs> Go ahead and say that shit. <laughs> Go ahead and say that shit. We're going to make a meme out of that shit. I ain't going to say it, bro. I ain't going to say it because they're going to steal my shit. They're going to steal your shit anyway because yeah. we famous, sort of. But I really think, bro, we can prosper from it, bro. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like Michigan and Detroit is going in a, in, 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 in certain direction right now anyway. It's yeah. like on the up climb. 
know what I mean? Yeah, so for sure. What, so, you know, that's going to help to boost the up climb. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, I think Denver so. is fucking attraction with the skin and all that shit. And then, and then it just brought more people to go there. You know what I mean? Like That's I'm the like, thing. It brought more people, yeah, period. It yeah. brought more people. You know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? And I feel like it's going to bring more people, bro. People going to be probably be fluffed from down south trying to get back to Detroit that already went down there. You know exactly. What I'm exactly. So, I mean... Then you got people from Ohio because their industries is declining. Yes, so yeah. yeah, so people gonna try to come back in here. So I mean, exactly. I, I think we should do it, bro. And you know, just say make make Michigan great. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> make Michigan great again. Yeah, make Michigan great again. <laughs> Donald Trump. Uh, yeah. Right. You know what I'm saying? But you know, people just, I mean, it's a miracle drug, bro. Yeah. Let us have it. For you sure. Don't give a shit else. My man D Coney just checked in too. Shout out to D Coney and shit. Yo, yo. Who, uh, I think I think he has some affiliation with High Times and shit, so he know a little something about this. Yo. Yeah, so we talking about legalizing marijuana, but go ahead though. Just want to yeah, give him a shout out real quick. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, legalize it, bro. Right. It's, for sure. It's a miracle drug, bro. It, it helps for the skin. You know what I'm saying? Everything. For, yeah. for pains. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. For stress. <laughs> you feel me? Go ahead and say it now. One time. One time. Go ahead and say it. <laughs> Let go of the stress. It's smoke out of sand. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's so retarded. I think it's, I think it's the laugh at the end that kill it, though. You stupid as hell, dog. You know, straight up, though, man, because shit, man, that shit get away. These motherfuckers ain't got to take taking these Xanax. These housewives be taking that shit. Yeah. Fucking around. But see, that's what they worried about, though. I'm telling you. I'm telling Don't take you, away man. from the, uh, yeah, from from the pharmaceuticals, yeah. nigga. Yeah. Motherfuckers like my my daddy, man. My daddy never took a pill, bro. Yeah, but he smoked For all the weed. He probably <laughs> Right. For recreation. <laughs> but I Give me some of the pills, cuz. Man, been smoking my whole life, bro. That nigga healthy as a motherfucking break. Right. He love, probably don't look healthy, but the nigga healthy as a motherfucker. <laughs> he ain't probably don't look healthy. <laughs> <laughs> the nigga healthy as a motherfucker. Yeah, that was them ashy ass feet. Uh, that nigga don't look healthy. <laughs> Stone feet, bro. He can cut the grass with no shoes or socks on. You know what I mean? He just. No, he be doing that shit yeah. for real. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen that shit. Yeah. I've seen it. Yeah. Like, look, you gonna cut so, your uh, fucking uh, foot. Uh, Flintstone. No, he don't. Right. I was just sold on that motherfucker. Six said extra soul. Got an extra soul on my <laughs> man. <laughs> Yo, on that note, dog, we go, <laughs> we go wrap it up, dog. But uh, I just want to say this, man. Definitely in Michigan, like I say, it's on the ballot for Tuesday. Do it, man. If you are, if you are voting, man, I, I guarantee that you should go out and vote in in approval voting, of that I shit. Ain't gonna vote. <laughs> right, I know, right. <laughs> But let's let's go ahead and vote it up, dog. And for this reason, like I said, I know they're trying to knock it down, saying that employment might get messed up or uh, productivity might go down or the crime might go up. But let's look at it this way. I'm not looking at it from that point. I'm looking at it from a financial longevity standpoint yeah. and from a health standpoint. Yeah. I mean, it's been proven that we have actually helped people medically. You know what I'm saying? And they're actually using that in the medical in the medical field. So I think that that's definitely the upswing. And also financially, man, this is an opportunity for people who actually are in this industry. To go ahead and make some money off of this industry and actually prosper by doing so. You know what I'm saying? So on that note, that is definitely the reason why I'm going to go ahead and vote for it. You know what I'm saying? My man 2G just popped in. What up, bro? <laughs> yeah. My nigga beat Rad and shit. What up, though? Killer K in this bitch, man. You know what I'm saying? What up, though? We got the whole squid eye. What up, baby? What's 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 Shout out to everybody who just came down in this bitch because there's too many people to talk about. My man 2G just popped in. Uh, Killer K, the, wait a second. Killer K in a minute. It's, it's, right. Session, but y'all, it's time for the session, dog. It's a wake and bake show. Look, it wait, brings wait. groups together. And right, it brings groups together. Right. Nah, you know what I'm saying? The wake and bake Right. The wake and bake is friends. For sure. Yeah, you know, look how many people came in. We might be close. Hey, you got a blunt? Right. I'm happy. On that level, it's time to blaze up, dog. I got my nigga Monk Money holding it down. Now you know what it is. And of course, it's your boy, man, the hood. Howard Stern Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. Hey, tell him what you say, dog. Let go of the stress. Smoke out the sass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bro. We up out here, dog. Peace. Let go of the stress and fill on some bread. <laughs> <laughs> he said that too. Huh?